Hello guys and welcome to another Body Stenics tutorial. If you're new to our channel, be sure to start off by subscribing and hitting the bell icon for notifications so that way you don't miss any future videos just like this one. In today's tutorial, we're gonna take you guys through a deep analysis on how to increase your slow max reps as well as your fast max reps. By targeting these two concepts, your slow and fast reps enables you to build endurance more efficiently across the board in calisthenics. By being able to monitor your reps, but as well as your technique, execution, and breathing all at the same time is what builds a phenomenal calisthenics athlete in the long term. This equips you with the necessary knowledge on how to improve details in your training as well as your performance and gives you the experience necessary in order to be able to train all by yourself efficiently and see progress across the board in calisthenics. Let's begin with how to increase your slow max reps. Your slow max is pretty much exactly what the phrase suggests, executing slow and performing non-stop until fatigue. This means that focus should be on monitoring your breathing, slow exhale on the way up, as well as a slow inhale on the way down, along with focus on maintaining the best form possible, hollow body and scapular engagement, regardless of which exercise we're performing. Constant scapular retraction maintenance in pull-ups and constant hollow body and scapular protraction in push-ups in the top and bottom phases. Key with the slow max is form, as well as no pausing either at the top or bottom phases of any rep movement. Indication that you must stop your set is when form is lost, either the hips are piking or the scapula is sinking, or if you find yourself pausing either at the top or bottom phases throughout the set. Now let's discuss how to increase your fast max reps. Your fast max is pretty much executing as quickly as you can, but not too fast to where you will lose form or rhythm whilst breathing efficiently with quick exhales and inhales as we come down and up. In pull-ups, we must focus on not letting loose of the scapular retraction as we come down. Seeing as though we're gonna be coming down fast, it's all more important that we maintain adequate scapular retraction engagement. Explosive pull-ups as well as muscle-ups are also a great part of training and worthwhile increasing your max reps with a fast execution. Dips are also a great exercise to increase your endurance as well as explosive and mixed grip push-ups on both the floor and the bars. When executing your fast max on your dragonflies, ensure that we are not losing form or hyperextending the spine at any time or piking the hips to cheat the movement. And once again, an indication that you should end your set and not do any more reps is when you're pausing for rest either at the top or at the bottom or when you're losing form in any part of the body. Hey guys, let's go for a max push-up attempt.
So keeping all these cues in mind, ensure to practice once a week your max reps and ensure to always go as max as possible. Body Stenex. Subscribe to Body Stenex if you haven't already in order to see part two of this two part series on how to increase your skill max reps as well as your static hold max times. Thanks for watching today's tutorial guys. If you guys found value then be sure to subscribe and also hit that bell icon for notifications. We upload a new tutorial every Wednesday and Saturday at 3 p.m. European Easter Summer Time. For those athletes who want a more in-depth approach to their calisthenics progress, be sure to get your own copy of the 100 Calisthenics Secrets book. And for an even more depth analysis on how you can progress as an all-round calisthenics athlete, be sure to get access to our exclusive Ultimate Calisthenics course. And for those athletes who want to join the Body Sthenics global family of athletes who are taking their skills and strength to the next level, be sure to apply for online coaching today in order to fast track your progress and achieve elite calisthenics status. I'm George, Body Sthenics coach. See you guys in the next video. Oh,